welcome to my channel. My name is Bubbly Simi. Um, this is actually my first video and today I'm going to be building a modern glass home with a, a greenhouse. It's like a basement greenhouse, which is really cool. I actually got the idea um, from The Sim Supply. I know he's built something kind of similar to this, um, but I wanted to like play around with the new glass houses that we just got. Glass houses, I'm <laughs> sorry, uh, glass roofs. I'm so excited to get glass roofs. I love building modern homes. That's like my favorite thing. But I do want to do kind of like a modern um, classic homes where they're like kind of run down on the outside, but then on the inside they're fully like up renovated and everything's kind of new um yeah i have been building on the sims i think it's been two years now since i've played the sims um it all started <laughs> when me and my brother started playing the sims 3 on ps4 and i just like fell in love now it's so different uh playing ps3 on ps uh ps sims 3 on ps4 on ps3 because it's so different to build like with the control. I don't even think I built. I just got into like gaming, but then I went on YouTube and I saw a bunch of speed builds, and I had to have like Sims 4. So I got it on my computer. My computer's not that great. It's like a 2010 Mac, <laughs> but yeah. So I got it on my computer, and then yeah, I just decided, you know what? I'm gonna start building videos because. I want to have fun. I want something in my life to be fun. <laughs> so I started doing this. I do follow some YouTubers, um, some Simleys on YouTube. Um, Deli, Deligracy, she's my favorite. Uh, Sim Supply. Uh, there's. Oh, that's my phone. I don't know why my phone is up. Okay. <laughs> Pixelade. I watch Pixelade. He's pretty cool too. I watch a, like not that many. I'm really picky when it comes to watching people, but I'm like open to watching a lot of uh, like speed builds and let's plays. Um, they're really interesting, like the storytelling and stuff. I'm so jealous, I cannot tell stories. But anyway, let's get back to the build. Um, so, yeah, so this is like a loft, like a one bedroom. Um, I don't know, it's like a basement loft, it's not really a loft because. Um, I built a loft before when it was like upstairs. It was really cool. I'm gonna rebuild it again because I didn't. It's not saved on my game anymore. Oh, um, by the way, if you do want to download this, uh, this build, it is on my on my profile on on oh, on the gallery. <laughs> I'm sorry. It is on the gallery. It's under Bubbly Simi. Um, so yeah, this house is available and some of my older builds are there too. Um, I'm trying to improve my building skills. Like, I'm so jealous of simmers who can, like, build such a realistic looking build. You know, I don't understand how <laughs> they can do it. Um, I'm just learning, so I'm hoping to, like, improve with, you know, sharing my videos out there. And, making them perfect that's like my goal like I want them to look kind of realistic because I know how fun it is to play you know with a game with like a realistic home so I don't know this game is fun I wanted to be an interior designer when I was younger so yeah and I watch a lot of HGTV shows like Property Brothers and stuff so anyway back to the build so this is like a basement loft I have um, the bedroom and the bathroom downstairs and then that on the side that's where the the greenhouse is going to go sorry my voice just like cut off really weird um so yeah I I um I was inspired by uh, the sim supply he did a build kind of like this recently um and I just wanted to do my own like I said I wanted to play with the glass roofs I wanted to make a, a glass house this isn't really a glass house because the windows and stuff I did change I think I did change those windows. Uh, yeah, I did. I did change them, but I should love those windows. But it's kind of like too much for this build. Um, so yeah, I wanted to do 
like a glass house because of the glass roofs. By the way, I'm really excited that we can do L-shaped couches. I haven't played The Sims in a while because I've been busy with work and stuff, or like when I had a job. Um, so I wasn't aware that we can like make L-shaped couches. I love those couches. Those are my favorite. And those are like my favorite floors. Although I should have gone with like the browner ones because now it's like kind of too dark, but those are my favorite floors. Um, but yeah, like the L-shaped couches are like my favorite. Um, so yeah, the kind of houses that I'm going to build on my channel. I want to do kind of like, uh, kind of like, not rundown houses, but houses that need like a little bit of TLC. And in my mind, like the story would be like Simmers who, I mean not Simmers, a family who are just like starting out and they have like this like fixer upper and they've done some renovations but then they kind of ran out of money <laughs> so they had to stall out so it's like kind of semi -re uh, renovated so I want to do kind of like tutors a lot you know a lot of tutor like bungalow tutors and stuff like that they have that kind of like kind of layout like my friend she has one no, she has one she's she's uh she lives in a tutor and it, it doesn't look like it's not run down but it's like a little it needs like a little TLC on the outside but on the inside is beautiful like the floors are definitely fixed up and yeah I kind of want to do houses like that uh, for the Sims I do love modern modern houses so I'll definitely do something like that I want to do let's plays but I don't know if I can like I don't know if I can do storytelling like that. I, I've seen so many like similes. They do like really good storytelling, <laughs> like Let's Plays, like Dolly Delicacy. She does really good storytelling, and I'm like, oh, gosh, I can't. I don't know. I have to like sit down and think about it. I'm not sure. <laughs> I'm not sure if I can do it. Um, but yeah, for now, I'm gonna stick to like um, Sim Speed Builds. Uh, I love watching speed builds. I'm not sure, you know, what type of speed builds you guys like to watch. Uh, if you like music or talking. Um, I was trying to figure out what kind of music to use. Uh, it's like, not complicated, but there's so many rules on YouTube. I think because like, I'm starting late in the game, there's a lot of rules. Like, so many with like, songs and, you know, what can get demonetized and I'm like okay I'm like just want to have fun but you know at the same time it'll be like I want to share my content out with you guys like I don't know the sim community is very friendly uh, I did join this new thing let's see if I can find it it's called discord and um and then I got it from I I I got the link on Twitter from Sim Guru Kate. Yeah, Sim Guru Kate tweeted about it, and it's like a community full of simmers and streamers, and you know Twitch, and it's pretty cool. I'm I really like it. Uh, I haven't really been on here so I'm like doing I'm actually like painting my room <laughs> which is really hard because our walls are like really dirty <laughs> but yeah so I'm doing some renovations at my house not renovations like paint stuff so I haven't really been on here but the time that I have been it's really cool like there's a lot of people like simmies and um, you know um, speed builders, Twitch. So yeah, the community is really nice. Like everybody's so kind. <laughs> That's what I've noticed with like sim, like simmers, like sim community. You guys are super nice. So I wanted to like start building, and you know, yeah. Anyways, back to the build. Uh, so yeah, that was the little kitchen area. So like I said, it's kind of like a loft. It's like a one bedroom loft. Um. You can expand, like this house is, the lot is pretty big, so you can expand, there's me like switching the windows, um, <laughs> I put those inside out, <gasps> anyway, you can expand, um, 
the house you can probably make it bigger and add like another bedroom you know um, down there down in the basement um, or you can if you don't like if you don't have like the seasons the season expansion pack you can definitely knock down that basement part and just put more bedrooms on there I honestly <laughs> recommend like if you're new like at Sims I honestly would recommend getting the season expansion pack because I feel like that's what the game has been missing like it makes it feel really realistic like I love it I love that it's like a little bit of realism I like I said I've been busy like I've been trying to see how like this YouTube thing like works so I've been kind of busy I haven't really had a chance to play yet um but I don't know it looks this looks really cool I put my uh, my days and you know how like the seasons like seven days I did it for like 28 days so that I can look so I can feel more realistic Anyway, so I am building like the little greenhouse area. I didn't use a glass roof. I kind of wanted to do like a, I don't know what that's called. Like I'm missing, I forgot what it's called. Kind of wanted to do kind of like that <laughs> roofing so that the sun gets in. And if it ever rains, um, this is in Oasis Springs. So if it ever rains in Oasis Springs, like I said, I haven't really tested it. I haven't really played it that much. So I'm not sure if it rains in Oasis Springs. I know that like the seasons are different in hot weather, kind of like in California. It never rains here. I think we only got like one week of rain this year. Or maybe a couple weeks of rain. Um, but yeah, the weather's being weird, really weird right now also. Like it's summer. But I remember last year during summer it wasn't as cold. So I don't know. Weather's being crazy. But anyway, Okay, so if you're new at playing Sims, I highly recommend you getting the Seasons Expansion Pack because, I don't know, it gives so much depth to your game. Death to your game. Also, like, the build and buy items are really, really cool. Like, I'm all about build and buy. Sometimes I buy something for, like, the Sims just because of the build and buy. Um... I think like bowling the only reason I wanted bowling was because of the side tables <laughs> so that's why I got it because I was really wanted the side tables um, but yeah anyway um, so I put some planters down here for your sim to play also put like a little beehive and then like a florist um, I don't know what that's called the florist station for your sims to build like flowers not built uh, to make flowers or stuff and sell it make a little bit of extra money um yeah I'm putting some windows on here because basements even though like I have the roof opening the payment the basements are always kind of dark so I just wanted to to like um a lot more sunshine in the basement like even though it's a basement it's not really a basement so <laughs> that's what I wanted to do so I added kind of like this little I don't know it's like a green patch this house is definitely for um, like the green thumb sims <laughs> if you want to like focus on planting and flower arrangements oh there you go <laughs> that's the word and then I do put like a little like outside um, porch area later on um, this is definitely for like an outside simmer or you know whatever like a bachelor simmer but I wanted to do kind of like an outdoor not outdoor thing like a like a garden not garden yeah like a garden thing but like like out in the sun here in California I remember my grandma had a house in um, she had a house uh, near me when I was younger and I remember she had like a little garden area and it's kind of like a greenhouse I can't remember it's like a lot of greens outside back in the day it wasn't you know it wasn't as hot <laughs> as it is back then but I remember she used to garden a lot so I kind of wanted to do something like that with like you know focus more on like the greenery you know um, I did I love the fact that we have closets. <laughs> I did put some closets. I did put a dresser here. Um, it's 
kind of like a small little room. Like I said, it's like for one person. I'm not really sure how much this house is. I, I know, I remember, I said it was cheaper than my other builds. My other builds are kind of pricey. So my goal, my goal for you guys is to try to make some houses that are not as pricey. So it can be like a true fixer upper. Um, I already have some ideas for more videos. This is like my first video and I was just playing around. I was really happy with the way I edited it. <laughs> I don't know, it's a really simple edit. I just used iMovies. Um, but I was really happy how it turned out. And I'll definitely play around with it more. And I hope that you guys can give me some love and support and subscribe. Um, you know, I really want to share like content with you guys. Um, speed builds and hopefully in the future when I get a mic and like, I don't know, better computer. I can do some let's plays and, you know, story ideas too. <laughs> um, we'll see. Um, so for now, yeah. Uh, anyway, so yeah, I was just decorating the room. The way I build is kind of weird, like, I don't know, I never put, like, I never put, um, wallpaper up. I feel like there's not that much of a selection for wallpaper in The Sims. I wish we had more, or I wish we can, like, customize it. But yeah, I love that rug. Like, I want that rug in real life, like, so bad. I love the, the abstract and, like, the, sh the like, stripes and stuff. I really want that rug. So anyway, I just used the gray. I'm actually painting my room gray, so I was like, oh, gray. I'll just use gray. I'm doing this to the to my room also. <laughs> like, one dark wall, and then, like, well, it's, like, a dark gray, and then the other side is, like, it's gonna be, like, light gray, so I'm pretty excited. Um, anyway, yeah. Anyway, I wish there were more color selections for wall paint. I always struggle with that. Especially outside, like, that exterior, you know. I really like that little book shelf thing. <laughs> That's pretty cool. Anyway, um, yeah, I struggle with like exterior paint for houses. I don't know why. I feel like it doesn't look as good. You know, I put it up and I'm like, okay, it's gonna look good. I don't know if it's because my settings are off, but it just ends up not looking good for me. I don't know. I'll work around with it and see what I come up with. I love, 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 love that. Um, sink. I forgot what it's called, but that sink. That we just, and that shower that we just got from the seasons. Um, I love it. I love industrial stuff. Like, a lot of this stuff, it's like traditional and industrial at the same time, which I really appreciate. Um, I kind of do hope, like I know, I think it was Sim Guru Grant who was tweeting um, while the seasons was coming out, or, like the days before. They were talking about like, farming and I really hope we do get farming only because I want to build like ranch style homes and kind of like yeah I kind of want to do that like I wish we had garages also oh my gosh just had like an excitement there like I want garages like please that'd be so cool like I was really glad when we got laundry stuff back and then I can build laundry rooms although this house does not have a laundry room it does have like the laundry barrel thingy um, outside in the hang thing. If you don't have that, that's fine. Those two I recommend getting. I feel like if you have seasons and laundry stuff, <laughs> it's like the best ones. I don't know. That's just me. But yeah, I love that wallpaper. Oh, and Parenthood. Parenthood is a good one also because I love that wallpaper. It's like my favorite. It's like my go-to wallpaper. I think I put that in the kitchen earlier. It's just a wire tile. So yeah, I love using that for the kitchen and the bathroom. Um, so here I am struggling, trying to figure out. There was more, I, but yeah. I always struggle with wallpaper. It's so hard in The Sims, I think. I think in The Sims 3, there was like pre- I never played Sims 3, I want to. But I know there's like, you know, pre- like, you can create your own colors and stuff. It's pretty cool. I wish we had that here. Um, I feel like The Sims 3 is a little, so I decided to add another one right here. One of those, like, like the same thing. Again, just to add more color, I mean, more light, um, because it's kind of dark. I don't know. I don't like when it's dark. Um, 
yeah, so anyway, I like The Sims 3. There's a simmer that I follow. He just changed his name, so I cannot remember. He only builds in Sims 3, and his houses are amazing. I think, like, Josh, I think his name is, like, Josh, or Builds by Josh or something. I can't remember. And my phone's, like, at 6%. Um, let me see. Um, but yeah. He built in The Sims 3, and his houses are, like, amazing. Like, it's just, I look at, like, how he manipulates the earth, like, the grounds and stuff, and I'm like, oh my gosh, I wish I knew. Like, I wish I knew how to build Josh. I remember his name. I wish I knew how to, like, build in The Sims 3, because I don't, I don't know. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I don't know. I forgot his name. He just changed it recently, so that's why I struggle to remember his channel. But his builds are awesome. So anyway, I did fill in that little dead space with a desk. So you have like a desk and a computer down there. Um, it's in the basement. I mean, I should have built like windows around it, but whatever. And then here, I just put like little shelves and stuff. Kind of like, I don't know. I just have a hard time filling the dead space. <laughs> um, so yeah, just put this little plant here. Like I said, this this build is for like people like Sims who like love plants and the outdoors. I feel like. Um, yeah, so I'm just building, I'm just putting like lights so it's not so dark at night. Um, but yeah, so I do like a, I like this. I really like the um the like the basement greenhouse. <laughs> like I did want to do like you know glass roofing. I want to play around with it. Like, I want to do, like, skylights in, like, traditional homes or something like that. Um, I know it's just, like, a... It's not really, like, a glass roof. It's, like, one of those, you know, those... I forgot what this called. They're called... Sorry, I'm, like, running out of breath. Um, the... Yeah, the roof attachment. The roof thing. <laughs> Gosh, I'm so bad. I gotta write down like these names, but I really wanted to play around with like skylights. Um, just I want to see if, even though it's not really like a glass roof, I want to see if we can kind of make it like it's a skylight. I don't know. I will, I will see. I will experiment. More. Like I said, I've been kind of busy. I've been busy trying to get this video up. Um, I want to have everything done, like intro, like time card, recordings. I wasn't sure if I was going to record a voice over if I was just going to put music um, because I don't have a mic, <laughs> so this is from my computer, so bear with me. Um, but yeah, I, wa I wanted to see, uh, you know, which style, uh, of, like, I don't know, will fit my, like, my channel, not my channel, but like me and how, what I'm comfortable with. Like, I wasn't sure if I can talk for like 30 minutes, but yeah. Anyway, I'm just adding like little like sand thing here to make it more realistic. I noticed it. I, I honestly just noticed that on one of the houses like next door that they build in The Sims. Um, they put like the dirt around to make it a little bit more realistic. So... Yeah, I wanted to do kind of something like that. I wanted to do them a little bit, um, like cookie cutter, kind of. Like, you know, obviously the houses don't look the same, but in the Oasis Springs, they have a lot of, like, modern style homes. And then in the, like, rich area, <laughs> what that's called, the, they have, like, a, you know, like, Spanish homes. But in this area, it's, like, modern stuff. So I want to kind of do, like, a cookie cutter home. Um, I do want to redo all the houses in Oasis Springs and just like, post, like, kind of want to do like a series of that. Like, the, the YouTuber I follow, I can't remember his name again, like I said, Josh, he did like, like mansions, uh, I don't know, like, yeah, like neighborhoods full of mansions, um, so yeah, I kind of want to do something like that. that was kinda cool. Anyway, I'm just adding some stone, cause I saw, I saw that on that you know, the creative room, like the locker room down or whatever. And so I just wanted to do like a little walkway down there. Because it's not really, like I just added the green. I don't know. 
I didn't know what to put down there. Uh, I'm putting another like um, roofing thing down here. I, I want to say it's called a mausoleum, but I don't remember what it's called. I didn't put any greenery, green, greenery up there. I wanted to do twinkly lights, but it's not big enough. I did struggle. I was looking for lights. I think I edited it out. <laughs> but I was looking for like twinkly, twinkly lights for like 20 minutes, and I looked like an idiot just trying to like fit it in, even though I knew it wasn't gonna fit in. So yeah, I wanted to do like an outside porch. I wanted to change the mailbox because I like that one better. <laughs> I wanted to do like an outside like porch thing. Like I said. I wish there was like a door directly to like to the outside. Maybe I could have put the stairs or something, but I don't know. I like it. Yeah, so here I was gonna put twinkly twinkly lights up there, but it wasn't, it wasn't short enough. It was too they were too long. I feel like I always struggle with lighting in the sense. Like there's not enough lighting. I don't know. Um just putting more lighting in. Uh, I think I'm almost done. I'm not really sure. Yeah, I'm almost done. Um, I love this. I love... Okay, like, here's another one. Jungle Adventure. The only reason I wanted to get the Jungle Adventure was because of the plants. So, the plants in Jungle Adventure are awesome. I did have, like, a little... I did try it out a little bit. Um, just to see. Also because it looked good with the rain. Um, I saw it. I don't remember which sim, sim guru it was, but he showed a picture of it when it was like raining and it looked pretty cool. So I'm like, oh, I think I'll just get that. <laughs> just for the rain. Also the plants. The plants are awesome. I love those plants. I remember we had those when I was growing up, so I really love it. Um, so yeah, I'm just adding some finishing touches. <laughs> I wanted to put those trees, but it doesn't really fit in. I was trying to see what fit in. Obviously like palm trees. And I was like mesmerized by the shadows. I recently like cleared out my computer, and so <laughs> everything runs more smoother now. And so I was like mesmerized by the shadows because I've had my game on like really low settings for a long time. So yeah, so I just put some, you know, that wash tub. I think I was looking for yeah the the water bowling thing. I highly recommend getting. Seasons. If you're new to Sims and don't know, like I know it's kind of pricey, but if you don't know like what you should add, what will add more dimension to your game, I highly recommend Seasons because it would add so, it adds so much. Like it's, it's awesome, it's so awesome. Like having The Sims be in sunshine for like ever. I think it was like five years. Someone said that's that's crazy. That's like in California where we never have rain. So. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know. It's pretty cool. See, I wish. Oh, I want to play with it more, but I don't have a chance to play with it. Anyway, I'm just adding finishing touches. I do put like an AC. Oh, I didn't show that part. <laughs> Here's the pictures um, of my build. I hope you guys like it, and I hope you guys subscribe. I will. You know be adding more hopefully advancing my skills or whatever <laughs> um so yeah like and subscribe my videos and i will see you guys next time bye